This meeting happened, uh, as you are all aware, close on the heels of the uh, uh, disengagement uh, and patrolling agreement and the resolution of issues uh, that had arisen, uh, had arisen in the uh, India-China border areas in 2020. Uh, naturally, the two leaders uh, welcomed the agreement reached between the two sides uh, through sustained dialogue over the last several weeks uh, in diplomatic as well as military uh, channels. Uh, Prime Minister Modi underscored the importance of not allowing uh, differences uh, on boundary-related matters to disturb peace and tranquility uh, on our borders. And in this context, the two leaders noted that the special representatives on the India-China boundary question have a critical role to play in the resolution of the boundary question and for the maintenance of uh, peace and tranquility in the border areas. Uh, accordingly, they instructed the special representatives to meet at an early date and to continue their efforts uh, in this regard. Uh, you may recall that uh, a Special Representative of India, uh, Mr. Ajit Doval, who is also the National Security Advisor, and the Special Representative of the People's Republic of China, uh, Foreign Minister Wang Yi, uh, also a member of the Politburo, have met on the sidelines of uh, international events, but they have not had a round of talks in the Special Representative's format since December 2019. So following today's uh, meeting, we hope to schedule uh, the next round of the SR's talks uh, at an appropriate date. The two leaders also uh, reviewed the state of uh, bilateral relations from a strategic and long-term uh, perspective. Uh, they were of the view that stable uh, bilateral relations between India and China the two largest nations on earth will have a positive impact on regional and global peace and prosperity. And both of them stressed that with maturity and wisdom, uh, and by showing mutual respect for each other's sensitivities, interests, concerns, and aspirations, the two countries can have a peaceful, uh, stable, and beneficial uh, bilateral relationship. Uh, as we have maintained uh, during the last four years, the restoration of peace and tranquility in the border areas will create space for returning us towards the path of normalization of our bilateral relations. Uh, officials will now take the next steps to discuss uh, enhancing uh, strategic communication and stabilizing bilateral relations by utilizing the relevant uh, official uh, bilateral dialogue mechanisms, including uh, at the level of uh, our respective foreign ministers. Uh, the two leaders also briefly reviewed uh, regional and international developments of mutual concern and interest. Uh, they agreed to maintain uh, close communication in this regard. Uh, naturally, uh, they also had a very productive exchange on uh, BRICS and the potential for India and China to enhance cooperation on this particular uh, platform. And uh, in closing, Prime Minister Modi also assured uh, India's full support to China's SCO presidency uh, next year in uh, 2025.